With your Thunder Update, I'm Erin Bailey. The 2016 season has come to an end for the Thunder and they finished the regular season with a record of 87 and 55. They then went on to clinch the East Division Championship against the Reading Fight and Phils in four games. They then took on the Rubber Ducks in the sixth championship appearance for the Thunder where they came runner-ups in the Eastern League Championship Series. It was a great season for the Thunder all around. The pitching staff lowered the franchise record for ERA with a 3.12 ERA in the regular season. Dietrich Enns had the franchise record for consecutive scoreless innings pitched with 23.2 scoreless innings. Dustin Fowler had our new franchise record for triples and became the fourth minor league baseball player since 1988 to have a stat line in the regular season of 60 plus runs, 80 plus RBIs, 25 plus stolen bases, 30 plus doubles, 10 plus triples, and 10 plus home runs. All in a single season. Tyler Wade and Jordan Montgomery were both named to the mid and postseason all-star rosters. And other great baseball moments this year were against the Portland Sea Dogs when Mark Payton had the tying homer in the ninth and then Tyler Wade came up to bat and hit a walk off inside the park home run to take the win against the Portland Sea Dogs. We also had another great walk off moment when Mike Ford hit a solo home run in the bottom of the ninth to win against the Reading Fight in Phils in the last regular season homestand of the season. Other great moments this season were Hope Week where we ended out with the Verse Cancer Foundation where players and front office staff members shaved their heads to support and raise money for this great cause. And the Thunder ended up raising over $10,000. The Thunder welcomed their 9 millionth fan into Arm & Hammer Park this season. We had movie nights, we had football and cheer night, we had hockey night, we had Irish Heritage Night, Jewish Heritage Night, and Jack McDade sang us countless national anthems, God Bless America, and even sung us into fireworks. We also had a Poke Monday this season where you guys got to come on the field and try and catch different Pokemon and battle each other to see who took over our gym. We had post-game radio shows at Killarney's and an A-Rod rehab appearance here at Arm & Hammer Park. And our team photographer of 23 years, Dave Schofield, retired and was named into the Trenton Thunder Hall of Fame. We had all those special moments and so many more here at Arm & Hammer Park, all thanks to you. The fans, thank you for being the greatest fans in all of baseball. Don't forget that this Saturday is the pork roll eating competition here at Arm & Hammer Park from 12 to 4 p.m. It's the second annual Cases Pork Roll Eating Competition and you can watch Joey Chestnut defend his title. We're gonna have craft beers, food trucks, a dunk tank, live music, and so many other fun activities. Don't forget to stay tuned to TrentonThunder.com and follow us at Trenton Thunder on Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, and Twitter to stay up to date on everything that happens through the offseason. For one last time, with your Thunder update, I'm Erin Bailey.